it's uh, Grant here at Gresham, and today I'm going to give you, let's call it an early Christmas present. So one thing we can do within our Crestron Flex range of products for Microsoft Teams and Zoom meetings, we can flip between the two. How neat is that? So here I have my Zoom room. So I've got a UC engine and a touch panel here and my soundbar. So it's a, a B series is what we call it. And I have a product here that's already set up, signed into my Zoom room. And but let's say I want to now start using Microsoft Teams. Hey, look, little sticker there too. Uh, I've realized that, yeah, I want to use Microsoft Teams uh, instead of Zoom. So what we have in our latest range of products that are shipping more, more recently, we have the ability to change the mode it's in. So there's two elements and we have the touch panel and we have the UC engine, the PC itself. So in the touch panel settings, this can be done locally on the touch panel via IP. Um, or by visiting the panel or essentially through our XIO cloud hosted in Azure. So I can come in here to Zoom rooms and change that to Teams video and hit save changes. Now that's going to send a command to the touch panel to tell it now come into the Microsoft Teams mode. So what about the UC engine? Uh, let's get rid of myself. So over here through XIO uh, I can simply come into the UC engine and go to settings and then I can actually change the mode of the application on the product. So I click save changes and now this is going to reboot the UC engine. There we go. So it's disconnected from the panel. So the panel takes about five minutes to uh, update and uh, swap over the modes and PC is really a reboot. So we're going to pause there and I'll be back in a second. PC is now rebooting. And touch panel will get a reboot in a second. So now you can see my room is ready. And it's got my Microsoft Teams uh, front room experience there with my customized background. So that's all ready. And so that will all be ready for the user. So again, what happens is if you've already pre-populated the details, it will save those details. So you don't need to visit the product anymore. But what we can do is again, using XIO Cloud, we have our remote eyes, should we say. So this is the ability to go and see what's on the touch panel through our remote control. So again, this is super easy to, to do this. So I can see what was previously on the screen there. So now it's going to uh, reboot and come back into the team mode. There we go, we can see the logo. So now we have the uh, touch panel rebooting. It's going to now come into the Teams mode. So what we see here, and if we refresh the screen, on the touch panel, we'll see it's now in the Teams mode. So that was super, super simple for me as a remote administrator, switch between Zoom and then to Microsoft Teams. That is really Christmas come early. So you've got the full uh, capability to do everything from here centrally, um, see the status of everything. And again, from here, you can see what mode it's running in. Uh, so you can see the platform it is, and then other items. So again, I can see I've got my uh, meeting ready here, all signed into Teams. And then if I had a cable connected, I could do my presentation. And then if I come here to my touch panel on XIO, I go to remote control. We'll let that refresh for a second. And then um, what I'll do, you can see the panel. So you can see actually here, you know when someone's viewing the panel, so people in the room know something's happening. And again, I can press it on XIO and it transfers it to the touch panel itself. So super, super simple for users to come in and manage using Crash on XIO and be able to stop presentation. So you've got full control of the touch panel remotely. Uh, super, super simple. So hope you enjoy that learning how to use Crashron in any sort of meeting room that you're looking at, whether it's Microsoft Teams or Zoom rooms, and switch between the two. Thank you very much for listening. Speak to you soon.